Thank you very much, Kulal. Uh, it is reported that the Polo Cross exists for the celebrity of the regional government land. I see the other Bushman to comment on this. Yes. Those in favor, see aye. Aye. Those not in favor, see no. The eyes are in. Good morning to all of you. Once again, I think all of you will have an uh, agenda item. But before we go, I must have a good agenda item. I want to welcome all of you at the High Commission to the committee. Welcome all of you for coming to give your time to come for this important meeting. So before we go to other countries, we go to the agenda item. If there is any, can someone move for the adoption of the with or without any It is moved. It's seconded, I seconded. It is moved and seconded. That the agenda, the other agenda, those in the room, the eyes have it. On that note, um, good morning once again. Members, clerk, SMS. I promise our members, uh, operators, uh, <coughs> present and part of the council, Amir, uh, media officials, good morning to all of you. Um, before us, we have a very important agenda to discuss, and all of the other members have already uh, adopted the agenda. So before we move further, uh, I would like Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My name is Bakari Nyasi. I'm representing at Crossbury Travels Limited, the height operator. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My name is Kijatuba. I'm representing Al-Ghazi Mutawadu. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa Alhaji Baisen II, member of the commission. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Jafar Fadil Dumane, Abu Dhabi. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Muhammad Jari, Hajjai. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Hadid Mbai, Amanat Wa'alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Good 
morning, Musukuta Farm National Assembly comes. Strong message to this particular ministry. 
but this is not the first time. So I, I can remember this is the third time they are abstaining without informing us. So it is not done. Thank you. Thank you very much, Honorable uh, Conte. Thank you, Honorable Chair. And you know, you are all welcome under the leadership of the Amir of, of the Mahaj Commission. Um, it's like, you know, I'm going to repeat what Honorable um, Conte has just highlighted. It's a total dismay and disheartening to, con to invite a ministry which is under our purview for a meeting which is geared towards nation building. And that particular ministry is giving um, a deaf ear to our invitation. It's serious. The parent body of your um, commission, whatever discussion that we are to do here, these people need to be here. And you know, the commission, you know, you know, our class, every class has communicated to them. And you know, today is only the first time, now it is the second time or third time. It is, it is like a routine thing. I think, Honorable Chair, yes. we need to you know, take a decision on this. This is, of course, the National Assembly. The um, National Assembly has, of course, given a power to this committee to be inviting agencies, ministries, which are under our purview for a meeting. Failure to do it once, two, three times, I think we need to take a stop, sorry, a step against that. I don't know the reason why they are not here, but what I know is that They've, they've been communicated to. And in fact, if they have a reason of not coming, they should, of course, to communicate to us. But there is no communication. The only communication that was done was, of course, from our side. It's like we are not uh, uh, decoding, they are not encoding. We are sending, they are not responding. It's too sad. <coughs> this is, of course, no. I'm totally disappointed with the ministry, honestly speaking. And we have powers, which we, we can, of course, rely upon to punish whosoever is trying to you know, go against, the, um, uh, you know, against this committee. You know, nobody, no one um, no, among us here has, of course, you know, brought him or herself here. We were elected by government people. Whatever we are doing here, we are doing it on behalf of those people. And you know, the ministry also, whatever they are doing down there, they should do it on behalf of, on behalf of government people. Nobody can put yourself in this position where I am. I cannot put myself in this position. I was ele I'm elected by the people of Lower Bali to represent them. So if I don't represent them, I should represent them well, which is, of course, in accordance with the uh, laws of this land. Likewise, the ministry, including the minister himself, he should be here. I'm very much disappointed in him. And in fact, if he's here, I tell him on his face that, no, I am disappointed in you. I cannot hide this you know, in, in me. Thank you. Thank you very much, Honorable uh, Minister. Uh, actually, the purpose of uh, uh, these committees is just to enhance our relationship with the ministries. So, actually, whenever we call, call them, they should be able to call them. Because they cannot go without us. Because, in fact, they are day to day uh, operation. They can do it, but the resources that should make them to operate will be allocated to them. So basically, I think we should work together, and when they want as a new cause, that's the law. You leave everything and come and answer to the you know, committee. And we are not here to be drunk, but we just want to put our efforts together, our ideas and opinions together, to make a positive move towards in impacting, you know, the lives of Gambia. So on that note, uh, honorable members, I think um, <coughs> I will also use the opportunity before we start to yeah. thank the High Commission for our good working relationship as the chair for allowing, giving me the privilege and the opportunity to go <coughs> to see and perform oversight on the High Commission for this 2024 Hatch. We definitely we commend you, we thank you for that. And this has really, you know, give me an idea.
so that you know I will be able to advise my colleagues. So today, uh, I am a different chairman based on the knowledge I gained from the 2024 action. So I will use the opportunity to thank the commission and all the operators for definitely taking our Gambians and you know at least uh, you know, at least give them the opportunity to perform their fifth the people of Islam. So on that note, we thank you very much. So without uh, further ado, we allow the presenter to present, and later we can get into the commission, uh, to the discussion. Thank you very much. I just want to ask a question before we move. Yes. Sorry. In the absence of the, the minister, the permanent secretary, and the secretary of the commission, can we carry on or we can we can we can postpone it, give another date, which you know everybody will be here because I don't want to be make a meeting and then make a meeting again. You know, we don't have time. You don't have time, you are busy, and we too are busy. I'm just asking if at all that can be or not. Assalamu alaikum. Officer. 
that is if it goes to the extreme that we've been requesting for some of it and the person fails to attend, we can still use a police officer to issue those summons. And the standing orders are very clear. It has even given us certain powers uh, that, that, that are given even to the courts as far as summons are concerned. And it is very clear that we had a written letter. Can I check the date? We had a written letter that was written by our committee clerk to communicate it to the ministry. But as far as I know, there is no there is no com official communication from the ministry that is stating the grounds of their absence. And according to the act of the High Commission, since we are looking at the report of the High Commission, according to the act, um, it says under section 6 of the act, that the secretariat of the commission shall be the ministry responsible for religious affairs. And I believe that should be the Ministry of, Religio, uh, of, of Regional Government Lands. And then it says on the subsection 2 that the Permanent Secretary of the Ministry responsible for religious affairs shall be the Executive Officer of the Commission and shall be responsible for the implementation of the policy of the Commission and the transaction of the day-to-day -day business of the Commission. To that effect, I think your question is very valid here. If you are to present something in their absence, I don't think we are doing the, we are following the right procedure. And since our committee has written to them, it should have been fit for them to be here before you present this report to us. Because our direct contact should be between the chairperson and to the to the to the to the secretary to the secretariat, which is housed within the Ministry of Religious Affairs. That would be my submission on the chair. So to that effect, I believe we should adjourn until a better day wherein we will have all the officials that are responsible as far as this report is very uh, is concerned. Because we might have issues that we would want to raise and we might have issues that we would want to bring the attention of the ministry. Because these are things that is that are affecting the lives of our people who are going to Mecca. And I think as members of the parliament and as mem members that are representing the public, we should take it as important as possible to make sure that any important issue that is addressed in this, that is reported here, we, we find ways of addressing it for the benefit of our pilgrims. Thank you. I so Thank you. Thank you very much, Honorable CC. This was your short mission, I think, still now. Uh, yesterday, for your information, the PS called for me about we discuss about the yesterday meeting because they failed to come and that's because giving me the reasons why they were not able to come. But for today's meeting, uh, categorically I reminded her and she even told me that uh, the PSC is also doing in them. So I don't know why that uh, the is not here. And normally uh, because we have our standing for this, but the committee also, we have our activity plan. And normally it takes time for our committee secretary to do all these things. Because as a committee, we, we, all, we want to achieve something with all of you together. But now, in doing that, we have to be effective in doing our things. So basically, the ministry is there, but they, whatever the case is, whenever we call, they should be here. That's the reality. And we cannot just take the skills of attending or not receiving uh, letters on time. Even if that is the case, you mentioned, you can call either the committee club or the chairperson. At least, you know, you discuss with him or her so that at least we can come to terms. Because at the end of the day, it's going to delay us as a committee. Because we have a lot of things to do as a committee. And today when we adjourn this, I don't think we can have them again till maybe next year, 2026. But I think this is the last committee session for this year. For the 25th. January, till January. Yeah, till January. Then we need to, you know, discuss issues 
in preparation for the 2025 Hajj. Because Hajj is very, very sensitive. It's our own Gambian who normally go for this. So, to, you know, we really need to take it serious. So, I don't know for what reason they have not come, but as a committee, we can take a decision. Uh, this decision is yours. And whatever decision you take, we can, we can do that, please. Thank you very much. So, Yes. Sorry. Thank you, Honorable Chair. Uh, in our in-house, if I could recall, in our in-house arrangement before they came, we discussed about this whether we can proceed or not proceed. Uh, like you said, considering the fact that we are dealing with a very important sector, and considering the fact that we have a scheduled time to deal with activities, we cannot allow one person or one institution to hold us at ransom. We are dealing with national matter. Uh, I agree totally with the responsibility that the ministry has with regards to the Hatch Committee, as, as alluded to by my comrade, colleague. Uh, and it is disappointing that uh, we do not hear from them why, why they are absent and they have not been here yesterday and this is a very important ministry and they are dealing with us directly. So I think they should take this matter seriously and ensure, in fact, our chairman should not even have called for, to remind them about the meeting and they given him a name subsequently who would never turn up. It, that is disappointing and we want to condemn that at the level, uh, 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 at the level of the ministry. But that notwithstanding, for me, my opinion is we should move on with the meeting because uh, the, the, this has to do with administrative work and the commission, even in the act, the quorum for the commission is four members. Meaning even at any sitting of the commission, even if that secretary is meeting, is, is, is missing, the, the meeting, if there is quorum, it can still proceed. And even if the chairman of the commission is meeting, is missing, according to the same, the same, the same act, they can still hold meeting appoint somebody to sit in and hold meeting. So the fact that the secretary is absent and vis-a-vis -vis the, the ministry responsible should not derail us in what we are supposed to do. Because you've been to Saudi and they have conducted an activity. We should know what happens, what are the challenges, what are the good points, and we prepare better. We don't have time to wait. It is at the advantage of the ministry to be here, to inform us or defend or add their opinion on with regards to the report. But still, there will still be avenue to do that. But it is important that we move on because the, as far as I'm concerned, the com commission has a quorum. If I'm wrong, let them rectify that. We have more than a quorum. You have more than a quorum. <laughs> so it, it still business can move as usual because you know what we are dealing with is, is important. We have to know what the content of the report is. And subsequently, we, if there is so, should be any need to engage the ministry with regards to the outcome of the report, we surely will do that. But this meeting should move on. Thank you very much. Thank you, Chair. Thank you, sir. I hope all of you are, can speak English, sir. Yes. Are you? Yeah. All, all, all of them. Yeah. If, okay. if, if, if you can come, you can come. You can come. You can come. Maybe sir, Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much, uh, Honorable Baji. Honorable Baji, I think it is not um, our liking to come here and call the meeting. But we have rules and regulations that are, of course, not guiding us, which is the standing order. Uh, the standing order, you know, according to you know, um, based on um, the submission of Honorable uh, CC, um, the ministry should be here. Because you know, what we come to discuss here affects the ministry and, of course, the commission as well as the government people in general. Our discussion, we cannot do it to the best of no, our, we can do it to the best of our ability, but no, we cannot do it in isolation when these people are not here. They should be here. So what if they avoid Because, sorry, I'm, I'm coming. They, they are in the center of this. The ministry. No, no, no. Move on, move on. What I'm saying is, 
This man has read, you know, in person, you know, in the study court. Of course, we need to hear the, the report of, um, from these people. The report is coming from the commission. Yes, yes, the report from the commission. But what I'm saying is, what I'm saying, the report, no, that is no, no uh, coming from these people. Of course, no, we will listen to them. But no, we're going to discuss other, no, uh, no, uh, we, we, we're going to have other discussions which cannot be known gone in the absence of these people. That's what I'm saying. And, and no, no, Reverend Sisa has, of course, read more, uh, a person in the standing order, which says, um, both the ministry and the commission should be here. Uh, no, this is not coming from me, Honorable Baji. The two respect. Hmm? It is no, not no, coming from me. No, no, no. Continue. What Honorable Baji, you have submitted. Allow him. It is not me. coming from me. He addressed me now. Yeah. No, 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 no. He addressed me. He addressed the chair. He addressed the chair. Honorable <laughs> chair. <laughs> <There's>, sorry. Honorable <laughs> <laughs> chair. This is not coming from me. We are right on the standing order. Whatever we are to do here should be guided by our own rules and regulations, which is the standing point. I think well, if we are to you know, conduct any meeting, if we invited you know, any people which are, of course, within the body of, our, you know, of this committee, if they are not here, and the meeting, of course, some of the issues directly affect them, I think we should go by our own standing point. Like, the way we have examined before. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, as I always say, let's always try to do the right thing. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. So let's do the right thing. But uh, equally, let's hear from other. Yeah, okay. This is more than one. Thank you very much. Just trying to avoid repetition, as my colleague has already said. My colleagues have um, supported the relevant sections in the standing order. You know, um, that will compel the minister or the ministry to come and answer. In whatever business they have, they should come and answer. And then to say it is embarrassing because yesterday I had the flag talking to the PS. The PS acknowledged receiving the letter of the High Commission, but saying the other letter she received that she didn't see that one. Two letters were sent to her. She acknowledged receiving one, that is the High Commission, from a telephone conversation. I had her saying that. Mm -hmm. So I expect her to be here today, mm -hmm. or she sent a representative from the ministry to show how relevant, how important is this meeting. But um, I will say also, by looking at the agenda number three, is to, to present the report of the 2024 Health Commission before the committee. Let's allow, if I may uh, appeal, let's allow them to, to you know, present their report from the High Commission, the 2024 Health, without discussion. Without, if, if you have something to discuss, because mm -hmm. let's, let's remember we have a very short um, committee meetings in this one because we are coming for budget session. So we, we, we may not have more time only after budget session. So hence there is limited time. We let's allow them to, to, to present their report for the twenty twenty four H and then have this discussion. Let's take it from there. As a committee, we have to be bold enough to write to the minister a final warning then they will know our stand now. I will appeal for us, for them to for them to present according to the agenda today. Please. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Uh, thank you so much. I think uh, we are all reading from the same uh, page. Uh, the, 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 the intention is for us to have the ministry present with the health commission because they work in tandem you know, hand in hand, uh, including the quality. But I also want to appeal for us to proceed. Now, you know, the, 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 the standing order that is quoted is dealing with the issue of summer. Mm -hmm. If you want to look at the issue of uh, what we are dealing here is the issue of operation of the committee, where we have our powers to decide whether we want to proceed or not. So if we want to look at it, we can look at it together. 
and see how best we can proceed. Uh, the, if you look at the agenda also, it talks about the, you know, just the same thing we'll get in the report. And those that are supposed to do this report are here. So let's, let's listen to them and see where they, 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 they made you know, progress and where they have you know, challenges. Then together we see how best we can advise each other. For the issue of ministry, whenever we have the opportunity, because this for me this is a lost loss opportunity for them to hear exactly what happened you know, during the last the recent concluded hatch. <coughs> but since they are not around, we can proceed. Whenever we have them, we can deal with issues that affect them directly. You know, we can what if there is any other issue that the ministry need to respond to in this particular meeting, we can put them aside and then deal with the hard commission since we don't have time and having another slot during this committee uh, session is yeah. going to be a problem. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I have a I have a that's yeah. that's another yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. Honorable yeah. Joe. Yes. Good morning, everyone, and uh, I will chair. I want to seize this opportunity to welcome the Commission once more again. And uh, looking at the agenda, I will chair, I beg to differ with many uh, regarding the presence of the ministry. Uh, we are looking at the, the report of the 2024 Hajj before the committee. So here, in this instance, whether they are here or not, that shouldn't stop our proceedings. There are so many ways in which we can hold the ministry and they must be answerable to us. Budget is coming and that is one way of holding them. It's like running away from the parliament. It's like how we used to say it in Amity. You can run but you cannot hide. So if you are running in an open ground and you cannot hide, then, then there is no need for one to run. So here, once we need their presence, uh, they were notified. They were written to, and I think the High Commission also informed them. What is more important here is let us try to get the challenges, the key challenges that they are also coming to present in the in the Hajj. So based on that, we can come with our recommendations, summon the minister, and make sure that they are here. Once we call them, they, if they want, let them keep on dodging. Once they need their budget approved, they must come to us. So there we can also hold them and say that this must happen before we, we, we get your budget passed. Because we are heading to, we, in fact, they cannot even run for more than one month right now when they are not captured. Yeah. So, to me, whether they are here or not, let us continue on them. Time is precious and time is key. We cannot allow them to come up to here and nothing is done about this. Let us listen to them. Let, them go, let us go through the report. Because even whereas the ministry is here, they will only listen, like how we are doing it. Then from there, we can write our findings. And from there, we see what we can do and see how best we can support them in order for them to overcome those challenges as well. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Honorable uh, members, um, I think uh, what we need to do, uh, you know, because sometimes uh, our committees, even the assembly, we are dealing with standing orders. You understand what I mean? So our standing orders, uh, sometimes do affect our operations. It's like if you invite somebody, he's not coming, he's not coming, and you have your target. Meaning, if you say, if he don't come, you cannot proceed with your meeting, then it's going to delay your activities. So what, um, <coughs> I asked the clerk to bring the, the settlement. I was suggesting maybe, if possible, they can just do the presentation. There is a date allocated for the ministers to come for us to discuss about the local government act. You know what I mean? So we can slow them to come for that day with the high commission so that we can do the discussion on that day. I don't know whether you understand. Mm -hmm. they, are, they will just present. They will just present. It's just like how we do. You present before the you do the consideration. That's the time we will ask, members will ask questions. Why the ministry, the ministry representation is already here? Because whatever we are going to say here, in fact, the commission do advise them on policies and they need to. So at the end of the day, I want to make this thing also clear that 
is the parliament that invited or summoned the High Commission to come. In the normal system, the ministry should be here. So the, the High Commission is not here because of the ministry. It's the committee that invited them. That has to be very clear. That's good. That's good. And yeah, that is 2024. So what I'm suggesting, with your permission, honorable members, if we can proceed with the presentation only, then there will be no discussion. Then on the 21st, the ministry will come so that we can do the discussions and trust our certain things. So if that is okay, fine. If not, I can still give you the floor so that you can also come up with your own suggestion. Thank you. Yes. Yeah. Oh. I'm sorry, when, when, they, when they present, they will give us the report we have, then on the 21st, it's like, that's the day we are going to consider the report. You understand what I mean? So, and in fact, it's two reports. The High Commission's report mm -hmm. and my report. Mm -hmm. You understand what I mean? Mm -hmm. So my report, you will have it. But for me, mm -hmm. I can just present it based on activities that we have done in a very, you know, mm -hmm. but you will have the copy too. So, so that at least you can compare and contrast the so that's what I'm thinking. But all is in line. Yes. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, I have a question. We are doing our work. You know, we are doing our work. I'm going to ask you. 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 I'm going so, uh, yeah. yes. so I, I would say, like, you are the secretary, permanent secretary. Yes. Yes. So, you are secretary, minister, Wow. Wow. On the 21st, so, yeah. So, how about 24? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yes. With regards to the first uh, listing solution, like you know, in the report, it might it might touch different areas. You understand? So, it cannot go without discussion. It will be. A lot of opportunity if we if they just present without dis discussing it. Because that, the normal exercise is even at plenary, we only present report, we discuss on this. Area. So the issues concerning challenges that are at their level, observations we see in terms of success and challenges, we comment on that one. Areas that will require ministry to tell us something about that one. We can serve that one. That's what I was saying. But issues that deal directly with their operations, whether it's positive or negative, we can discuss that here. Because ministry is not present, they cannot respond to issues that are raised with regards to their activity. They are, they are good points or bad points. We can serve that one. But other than that, we can discuss about High Commission's successes and failures as far as the report is concerned. So the second issue is, the appointments where he said the rescheduling the date for that interaction. Yeah. You know, even if the minister is not here, you know, there are two PS in the ministry. Three. You understand? So three. Somebody is rectifying. Yeah. So one should be present at we don't necessarily mean you know it's, it's not be by force that at any time the minister should be there. We know there are travel schedules. But one PS should be representing the ministry at any meeting of our 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 our, our engagement. 
Thank you, Honorable Mr. Chairman. Take the floor, take the floor, take the floor yes, first. I'm, I'm taking the floor. No, you don't take it, you, are, you just speak. We don't you raise, respect, sir. No, 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 no. Take care. Sorry, wait. Wait. You raise your hand until, yes. Okay, I will Let's observe, you. yes, yeah. please. You, you request from the chair, then I will give you. Okay. Okay, that's the procedure. All right, sir. Yes. So, let's allow the members come up, then I will give you. Yes. 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 Okay, Thank you very much. Um, chair. I think uh, the issue of whether we should continue or not is what we have for us. So, I believe that Parliament is all about numbers. It's a, it's, it was an opinion, it was a suggestion based on what we have as rules guiding our proceedings. And the fact that a letter was written, sent, and then according to our clerk, it was received as indicated that official communication was done. Any other communication outside there, whether it's over telephone, whether it's personal conversation, is not considered in these circumstances as official. But then, like I said, parliament is about numbers. If the majority decides that we should proceed, well and good. But I also want us to know that the Saturday is also a working day. Mm -hmm. As per the Interpretation Act, there is nothing wrong with rescheduling for another day for us to meet with, with all the stakeholders. Because remember, you made mention of budget coming and saying that we should decide not to approve the budget or whatsoever as a way of punishment. We are not punishing the ministry, we are punishing Gambians if we do that. What we are looking at here has something to do with our people, people that we represent. And there might be certain things that we need to address during the budget session. And that is only possible if we address it with the ministry. Remember that the commission will not be before us during budget bilaterals. It is the ministry that will be here to represent the commission. Mm -hmm. If there is anything that the commission is seeking from us, they can only do it through the ministry. And if we have to approve budget lines for the commission, it is the ministry that will present that to us. So if we have to look at the report, we are just not looking at the report as, a, as members, but we are looking at the report you know, to look at the areas that they want us to come and support. And to that effect, it will be very, very important if the ministry is here to hear this directly from them whilst we are here. So that before the end of the day, we will be able to, to come up with resolutions as per how to come up addressing those issues, those challenges that are addressed in this report. I don't expect that the report will bring only positive things. There must be challenges that are faced by the Commission. And you've been there, Chair. We have a preliminary discussion. And according to you, you've visited areas where countries have sent in their delegations and they've been treated the way they've been treated. You expect our own Gambians to have the same thing. I know you must have felt that way. Oh, yes. So obviously, how do we see that we come up with resolutions, we come up with issues that will address those challenges that are faced by. You see, it's about representation. Even if the ministry, the minister is not there, or the permanent secretary is there, is not there. We understand that the ministry have two permanent secretaries. Permanent secretary is one hand. Three. Three. Or three. Even if it is not permanent secretary, there are directors. They can represent them, at least, to hear some of these things. So, but then, like I said, it's about numbers, and if the majority desire that we should continue, well and good. Thank you. Yes, Thank you very much.
Are you looking at time? <coughs> no, but not only this one. We have other students. When are you doing? Yes, you can go ahead. Salam. Yeah. Salam. 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 Salam.
Instead, what is going to happen? Mm -hmm. It's like we are going to suspend the performance report of the Ministry of Finance and whatever. Yeah. So we can have them on the 24th. Them and do what? Proceed. And do the whole presentation. So, because we, 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 we were at somewhere yes. when majority of members agreed that we do that. Yes. But so, now, I think. Hello. now, from them also, mm. is their report. Mm. This is why I want to hear from them whether we can still proceed without their ministry or not. If they want us to have a special day where all of us mm. will be present, Yes. Then we can do the discussion yeah. together yeah. and make it once and for all. You see, yeah. Oh, because the first generation was like, it's, a, it's, a, it's okay, at the level of uh, maybe PEC and FBAC, uh -huh. normally reports, when reports come, uh -huh. first day, uh -huh. you'll just present, mm -hmm. there will be no discussion. Okay. Then the second day, mm -hmm. that's where mm -hmm. We will do the consideration. That's where members will start asking based on the report. Okay. So this is the procedure. So that's what I was thinking. We apply that. Because of the time constraint, mm -hmm. for them to report mm -hmm. only the report without only. discussion. Okay. Then on the twenty fourth, when mm -hmm. the minister is here, mm -hmm. then we can you know, we can discuss. By then, all members will be informed and will get your copies, then you can you know, come up with your question and whatever. Then from there, we can also come up with certain recommendations and stuff like that. Because the thing is, I don't think there is any, it's not a fight. This is something that we just want to discuss as a family, the committee, the High Commission and the Ministry, so that we move together the way forward. So what the ministry need to help us, even if we happen to change the date for the consideration, they must be here. They must be here. Yeah, so I think that's because what I... right now, <coughs> if they don't come, it's going to constrain the commission, even the operators. Because also we are here as, let's say, a kind of a, a referee or whatever. So what is the best thing for us, we can just come up with, because we are not siding with anybody. But whatever is coming from the report, that's what we are going to consider, based on our submissions and recommendations. Yes. Yes. I believe our meeting with um, the ministry, the commission, we are not just going to look at uh, the report of this issue. There are so many issues that need to be known, looked at and ironed out. Like you said, we are like a reference between these two. I don't think no, this is the only issue that no, we are confronted with. And some of, some of the issues that are currently on table, when we are to discuss them, we cannot discuss them in the absence of no, one of these. Or, 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 no, in the absence of these two, that is the ministry and the high commission. And you know, my belief also is um, the report. If we are to have discussion you know, on the report, my belief is it should be in the presence in the presence of the um, ministry, like they, you know he rightly said, it is affecting all of us. So if any discussion is to is to take place on this issue. All of us will be here. We deal with it once and for all. I think that's the you know, um, best thing for us, for the Commission, and for the Ministry. But if we should, of course, no, um, have discussion on this issue, in the absence of the Ministry, at the end of the day, when the Ministry is here, honestly speaking, we'll go back to this report again. Mm -hmm. I, we'll go back to it again. So what is the essence of not having discussion on this today? And even these people, I'm coming, they themselves, the people who have just spoken, 
they are not in for the discussion. They, they want the discussion to be in the presence of the minister. I think you should not respect their opinion also. Yeah, then, then, then I think you are, you are fine, you are in line. So then, uh, Commission members, what do you think? Based on what uh, Commissioner uh, Imam Cham said, um, and the question goes by Uncle Pilala. Yeah, second. Uh, <coughs> so, I mean, uh, if I was FM, you okay. can say so, it's FM for no. Maybe for all the move to call, we want to come to the phone. We need better than that. We need a map. We need a map. We need a map. If we continue on this kind of trends, we shall never arrive at what we want to, want to uh, achieve. And I hear, you know, this Gambian attitude, the people might think somebody is speaking, and maybe in my, the way I understand it, he's insinuating that if they present, the ministry might see it as reporting. As the, we, are, we are beyond that. This is a country. It's in the report already. Whether you present it in, the, in, in their absence or in their presence, it's already in the document. It is my, so it's not my responsibility. Everybody should do carry out your responsibility to the best of your ability. We are here, we left our businesses to come and attend this meeting. You are here, you left your schedules to come and attend this meeting. Likewise, the ministry also have the duty to come and attend here. So I, I want to believe that the commission members, whatever they have put in this document has been experienced whilst they are in Saudi, not whilst they are in the Ministry of, of, of Local Government and Religious Affairs. So the person we are even waiting to come and attend the meeting might not have been in Saudi at the, at the time of their generating this meeting. He was not there. The matter at hand now is for the person to be informed about the outcome of the report. Does it mean here, if he's not physically here, we as the, somebody said, it, it makes no importance for, for, for them to present without the presence of me. That, that is a, misconce a misconception. That, that, uh, that's me or the body. No, not you. <laughs> no, no, from, from, no, 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 I, I started some of the, the GRA or something. But then, let, let, let me say this. Let me, let me say this. I, I speak the way I want to say this. It's very important to understand that if, look, look at the model we use at, even at, at, general, at General Assembly. Sometimes we go on tour, we report when the ministries don't even attend. But they have, the outcome of the report, and the, the minister's response will come. Let's use that model. Let them present. We will take the facts, take the issues, approach the ministry. So you look at, listen to what the commissioner uh, 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 is saying. Amir is saying now the issue of scheduling. It's another issue. So we are believing too much on the ministry should be here. They support. We all agree they should be here. But whose fault is it that they are not here? Should we all behold a ransom that they are not here, so nothing should happen, no one should go to work? And when the majority of the commission members are all here, it's not fair. Let's do the work. Maybe you, what I was thinking, we are debating on discussions. Even if we serve the discussions, that would have been pro. But I cannot come here, members come here on time to, to just sell everything because one individual is supposed to do his work. That's not correct. 
That's not national work. So let's present it. Even if you're going to self like the FPAC model you are saying, we do that. But to go home without presentation, if you skate on Saturday, you will not see me. No, and, Saturday, and if we, we will come maybe, maybe. Maybe. So maybe. let's do the presentation, maybe. save the discussions. <laughs> and then, because whatever you are saying, if, if whatever the challenges are, it is National Assembly who is going to put it to the ministry that this is how it's supposed to be done. So do not think the, 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 we are below the ministry. They are, we are the, 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 the decision makers here. So, but it's in consultation. You understand? So, when does that happen? That's the question. So, it, then we have opportune time to somebody mention the budget session. And all the challenges are doing are, are, has to do with finance and all those things. So, it's better we know at, at time and then know how to engage them. It doesn't necessarily mean we should waste all this time just and go home just because they are not here. In fact, there is no more time. I, I, there will be no more time. Let's present, please. No, 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 just, 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 just say a second. Uh, please, please, a second, yes. We have I think time. Uh -huh. all, this problem, all these issues that we are talking about, we are trying to you know, bring in blame game on each other. It's been caused by the minister. That's, that's we, no, there is nobody who should be blamed here today. Let's call it speed yes, yes, The yes. ministry should be blamed. If the ministry no, no, was here yesterday and today they are here, by now we must have at least been done with everything. Yes. So, sure. all the members, yes. I don't think it is fair to blame each other. Okay, mm. now, so no, I love no, this. In fact, sorry, there is no blame game. Mm. Let's try, you know, and, yeah, you know, it is, you know, because. There shouldn't be any blame game, yeah. because we are talking yeah, 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 yeah. about opinion. But I want to give Honorable KK Senior to also at least, uh, you know, see if he's opinion. No, no, but, uh, but I must have to give him that. Huh? No, no what, what, what you need to do is, I think we need to concentrate on what we are doing. So if the people have submitted their report, Let's discuss that. Yeah, let's discuss that. I think that's better now. So now, <coughs> so is it, uh, can we just do the presentation only? Yeah. Then we settle on the 24th for consideration. We are in the discourse. Whilst the ministry will be here. Yeah, I want to say something. Yes. Okay, thank you once again. You know, we are working by time. Huh? There's no more time. We don't have time. Hmm? Half an hour. Half an hour. There is only half an hour. Less than one hour. We have one hour. We have one hour. One hour, 30 minutes. We don't have one hour. Where are we finished? I have 12 for 12. Okay, thank you, thank you, Chairman. I I know it's not been easy. Uh, everybody wants something. Okay. Um, according to what I just learned from here. Uh, the commission, has, the commission itself, sometimes it's, it seems like they, they want to discuss in the presence of the minister. Mm. But that is not up to them. It's up to us, according to our rules here. But what I realize is we spend you know, all the time arguing or deciding, deciding whether to argue or not. And we, uh, we, uh, we schedule this time from 10 o'clock to 12.30. Now it is 12.30. And presenting this report without discussion, me, I don't see it as a presentation. The best thing is for us to adjourn. If we cannot proceed, if, in fact, we cannot proceed because there is no time. Let us adjourn and look at another day if it is feasible. If it is not feasible, then nobody will have, nobody will blame anybody. The ministry. Because we saw our intention to discuss whatever is happening. 
Now we have only 20 minutes. 20 minutes. Uh, you know. Sir, what are the rules for most time? 20 minutes and to present it. Me, I, don't, I just don't want it to be presented without having me having some. No, to so that one. No, no, we can sell that one. What they tell you, present it. Yes. Ask them how much, is how much time they need for the presentation. Yes, but, yeah. but the thing is. How much time they need for the presentation? Ask ah, the guy presented. How much? Oh, no, let's join. Let's join the wagon and. I'm not even joining. 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 You spend lots of time. What we're going to do? The clerk will write to the minister. Yes. With a strong statement. Yes. Strong statement. You know, citing all the year, yeah, at least for them to make sure by all means, only 24, they are here. Mm. I mean, they call me to go to the How many secret Yeah, they have their individual expertise. Mm -hmm. So, according to the plan, for 24, we will have a committee room. Because already that one is meant for our day. We take some programs for the board. So, so, we can certify that. But equally, also, when they come, they need to know that they are really delaying our work and time. So commission members, thank them for coming. We thank you and we are very sorry for not being able to proceed with the report because of the ministry. So and actually they should have been here. And as the chair on behalf of the committee, um, this is not what we expect. The ministry should have been here and so that at least we can deal with this thing. This is a national issue and we are all working for our Gambians. So on that note, the ministry has a role, the commission has a role, the National Assembly Committee has a role as far as this uh, issue is concerned. So on that note, we thank you and we apologize for not being able to proceed and we thank you for your time. So hopefully, we will write back to the ministry so that on the 24th, they can come, we can discuss as a family mm -hmm. and move forward. Mm -hmm. so, Mm -hmm. and move that we adjourn. No, no, we have a